Bill Hemmern, welcome here to America's Newsroom. As we ask that question, look for an answer. Big How are question. you? Morning Good morning, you. Bill. Good morning, everybody. I'm Martha McCallum. So the Russians apparently hacked, according to some, the White House computer system last October after a cyber attack on the State Department evicted. So two big cases uh, that we're watching that we could potentially get some answers on over the course of the next couple of hours. In the meantime, nine minutes past, the cancer... Expect any malicious yeah. activity, but there are some gremlins hiding somewhere so it's in, in the system. kind of a weird day, wasn't it? <laughs> it's a I mean, very the, weird the electricity day. goes out. The Russians hacked the White House yeah. system. Do, 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 Marie Harf, a veteran right there. I'll just so fire up the flashlight on yeah. my iPhone. And no on problem. The we go. No problem. Now, you do that in Oprah's going. studio in Chicago. Now, to be soon, California. Those are fight <laughs> words, right? That would be an issue. That would be. T-shirt. All right. So this is a raging. And not over yeah. till the fat lady sings. That's right. And she's not sung. Not no, one note. Had, or no, maybe a couple had. notes in yeah. some places. Man. <laughs> Hang in there. Hang in there, folks. So dramatic video of a fire that's tearing through a commercial building in downtown Los Angeles. Say, right? Boy, that's an amazing feat. Sure is. Hat trick for you, well done. Nicely done, lady. Well done, Congratulations. Mm -hmm. And to Gino as well. All right, so is the White House set to sit down? Thanks, Bill. So from the battlefield to a pond. Family. Wow, that is that is really, really special. Really special and precious too. And those silent, you know, quiet heroes uh, of that generation often kept their medals in a drawer and didn't talk about it. And now they know his full story, which is extraordinary. Yeah. Wish them well. Thank you, Steve. Cheers, poor. New hour starts now in America's newsroom. Glad to have you with us today. I'm Martha McCall. And I'm Bill Hemmer. Good morning. It happened early. Mayor in North Charleston will hold a press conference at 1 o'clock Eastern time, so about three hours from now. We'll see what he has to say. Obviously a witness. And what we're learning. The person who shot that video was a witness uh, to the entire thing, which is going to be a big element in this as well. So more on that as we get it. All right. Well, there are new warnings from the defense. Hey, what? Save us some taxpayer dollars there. Yeah. Bro. Well, pick up your change when you go through there. It's men. <laughs> it's definitely men because women do not keep loose change in their pockets. So it's the guys who are leaving behind no all question. the money. The quarters sure. count, right? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Never leave behind change. Well, there's a new synthetic drug that has very dangerous side effects. All right, we're watching this very closely because uh, a verdict could come at any moment. Well, a police officer charged with murder. Graham, Add the money. Right? Say he submitted it because there it you go. The email address. All right, come on, ESPN. Let's go. Save it make for it, college. Making all that money. Twelve. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're we, coming um, up on Kill Me, right? Yeah, we are. Did Brian invite us again this week? I think he did. I think we have to pay him, too, though. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll see you tonight on O'Reilly. Bye, Bye, everybody. Have a great day.